Let these Karenny dance like why do we Yo, I've had it up to here with Pam Yeah, always trying to get something for nothing With the greasy beads Always asking for change Ring it that little bell Wait, what? Cut to the news desk in three, two well, you know, it's uh, that most wonderful time of the year again, Jim. Are you ready? Purge night! you damn right I'm ready, Russ. Now we'll see who's a danger to themselves and others. Mrs. Sherry Big Shit Palms HOA Board of Directors. I know where you live, bitch, and I'm coming for you. And once I get your social security number, it is over. It is over, bitch. <laughs> no, no. I'm talking about a different magical night when a stranger forces his way into your house in the middle of the night. Christmas! Speaking of Christmas, a man was eaten by piranhas after jumping into a river to escape a swarm of bees. Uh, Jim, about that segue. Yeah? What about it? Never mind. Go ahead. A weekend fishing trip took a tragic turn when a Brazilian man drowned after jumping in a lake to avoid a swarm of bees. Wait, you said before he got eaten by piranhas. Yeah? So? Well, just now you said he drowned. Well, technically they chewed on him after he drowned, but it just sounds better. Look, watch. Okay. <clears throat> a man drowned in Brazil. Hmm. All right, all right, and now? A man was eaten by piranhas in Brazil. <laughs> okay, yeah, I see what you mean. Right? Totally changed up my funeral speech game. Speaking of funerals, officers managed to recover the man's body on the shoreline, but reported that the fish had torn open several parts of the body and tore open the right side of the face. The man's body was later released to his family for funeral arrangements. We're assuming a closed casket. I mean, either that or stuff them full of bread and throw them back in. That's what I call out of the frying pan and into the... Uh, piranhas. I was getting there. And now a word from our sponsor. Say, Russ, you know what one of my pet peeves is? Yeah, we already had this discussion. It doesn't matter if you name them rats or just rats. No, no, I'm talking about when somebody borrows something and doesn't doesn't return it. Oh, you mean like the social security they keep taking out of my paycheck that won't be there when I retire. Is that true? A Kentucky woman is facing several charges, including second-degree assault after she allegedly stabbed her cousin following an argument over a sex toy. That's right, Russ. According to the arrest citation, Denham told officers that her cousin Barton came to her home and they got into an argument over the sex toy. Uh, she borrowed it, and he said he wanted it back. It's just a whole rabbit hole of questions here. Like, one, who borrows out a sex toy? Yeah, and once it's borrowed out, who asks for it back? <laughs> the citation uh, reports that Denim told Barton to get off her property, and when he grabbed her by the elbow, she used the kitchen knife she was holding in her hand to stab him. So needless to say, Denim was arrested, and as a result was charged with second degree assault, second degree disorderly conduct, menacing, and resisting arrest. No word on if the sex toy in question has since been returned. You know, I never thought of myself as a prude until I took this job. Mosey on down to the sex toy swap meet. Come with money, leave with a possible STD. Don't mind the skid marks and check out our scratch and dent section in the back. Ah, look at that. Grandma's walking around with one of my horse dildos and she thinks it's a cane. <laughs> Grandma, that's not a cane, it's a horse dild. It's a horse dildo! She can't hear me. The real question is, what kind of sex toy was it? I'll give you a hint. It starts with S and rhymes with Brap on Milbo. Hey, look, commercials. Hair, wanna try the hot bob style? Don't cut it and regret ah! it. Now there's an easier way to get it. Hey. 
demonstration of the handgun that turns long locks into a beautiful faux bob. Faux bobs is my Aunt Roberta's preferred pronoun. And sexy in seconds. Get that red carpet celebrity flair without cutting your hair. It's easy. Just clip, tie, and tuck. Hot bob. Works for all hair types. Yes, all Caucasian of them. Bold, kinky and curly, or super straight. Just clip hot bob to the back of your hair. Make a ponytail with the gripping ponytailer. Slide it down. Tuck hair into hot bob. It's like tucking a t-shirt into shorts, but for hair. Down. If you can ponytail, you can hot bob. For those times when you want to be mistaken for a giant penis from the bank. Pins. The easy to follow style guide gives you fabulous bobs in no time. Oh, famous bobs is the name of my D and D guild. Flip sideways for easy French twists. Or help, we're trapped in a green screen and we can't get out. Get out or chic simplicity when stepping out. Perfect just to change it up. When you want to change, but you're too ugly to cheat. Still there. Call. Did you think I cut my hair? I really don't care. Because it's just hyper. Sheila, there are children dying in Africa. Accessories and four ponytailers for only ten. You'll be able to hot bob every long-haired hussy from here to Tuscaloosa. That's not all. You'll also get this stylish storage bag. To keep hot bobs, makeup, or hypodermic needles. First, call or click now. Honey, the kids got into the Novocaine again. Sip their drink cup slips, flips, and drips. Well, now parents can relax when they mess up. Introducing the spill-free Wow Cup. Teach kids how to drink out of a cup like a human being? Never! With the Wow Cup! Jump and spin, and the drink always stays in. It's like a sippy cup, except... Okay, it's a sippy cup. They're off. Then you can drink anywhere along the rim, just like a regular cup. No more spouts, livers, or caps to worry about. You know what else doesn't have any of those? A regular cup! He gulps down his... Look, Mom, I drink just like Daddy. Automatically seals itself. Amazing. Oh, I'm gonna... <laughs> Once you stop, it forms a water... <laughs> See you in hell, white carpets! Mom and dads will never clean up messy drink spills again. Or Did you kill again? Whose blood is this? Copies BPA free. Virtually. To demonstrate, we're gonna run over a toddler with his lawnmower. Use it to quench thirst on long trips or prevent embarrassing accidents in public places. And. Yeah, I gotta lay off the sauce. Whose teeth are these? All ages. Why hassle with straws, spouts, and small rubber pieces? With Wow Cup, just fill, twist, and sip, and it won't ever drip. That's right. You can put it in the dishwasher, along with your vibrators, and that casserole dish you keep rewashing. Ten dollars. But wait, order right now, and you can double the offer. That's right. Hee hee hee. That's for the homies that ain't with us no more. Just ten dollars. This offer is not available in any store, and supplies for this promotion are limited, so go online now. That's right. For the cost of one, we will send you two creepily happy white children. Offer not valid in Utah. 1787, or visit us online at www.wowcup.com. Uh, and I'm stuck. Your bathroom looks a mess. And why is it impossible to get out the last drop of toothpaste? Uh, There's got to be a better way. Smoke meth. No teeth, no problem. Toothpaste dispenser that works with just a touch. Touch and brush work with virtually any size tube and secures easily onto any surface in seconds without any tools. Stick it on grandma for toothpaste on the go. Favorite toothpaste, then pop on the cover. There's no electric or batteries to replace. It's that easy. It relies heavily on dark magic and the conjuring of demons. It's like a glory hole for toothbrushes. Are a thing of the past. The secret is our patented technology, Vacuum Force. As the toothbrush gently pushes the pump arm, Vacuum Force pulls fresh toothpaste from the tooth. Wasn't Vacuum Force a Pamela Anderson show? Touch and Brush uses every last bit of toothpaste, so there's no struggling for that last drop. Then when you're done, simply place in a new one, and you're ready to touch and brush again. Just use every last drop and then get a new one. Just like my bitch of an ex-wife. I loved you, Deborah. Frankie says if I don't build five flats by the first, it's gonna break my other arm. Looks great with any bathroom decor, and is also available in this elegant chrome finish. 
We also have one that looks like one of those Grateful Dead teddy bears. Fresh today for the amazing low price of just $19.99. But you didn't hear that from me. The cops asked I was never here. Toothbrush. Recommended by three out of five lonely housewives. Patience per minute. It disintegrates plaque on contact. Mom, why is my hair different than all my siblings? I can't hear you. I'm brushing. $50 value. Yours today for the amazing low price of just $19.99. But you've got to call now. What's squishy, stretchy, and transforms almost anything? Wait, I know this one. A Chernobyl reactor security guard. Cover it. That's the way you clone it. Look. At least that's the word on the street. Clone creation. Transform this wooden fossil in... Let me die! Ordinary toy car into a foaming fast dragster. Or turn your old junk into new junk by putting this junk on it. Foam sticks to almost anything. And when you're done, squish it back and start all over or let it harden and keep it forever. The foam is eternal. Start, but foam turns fun into a work of... Mom, why does it smell funny in here? Uh, that's just m Mr. Gaslake. Are you feeling sleepy yet? Creepy foam critters, or build an erupting volcano of foam. Plus, mix and match colors for any design you can imagine. So kids in the 90s used to like this stuff? Well, this and school shootings. So like now, but without the foam. Bingo. Costume masks, even foam rainbow glass. It's like a call for help in Archie Biff. Your bike, a scooter, a skateboard, your shoes. A cat, the Pope, a recently exhumed corpse. Help of Steve has a gun. It's fun you can feel. You want to stay covered after being wet, but your towel just won't let. Well, there's always my option. Is that the same option that got you banned from the Dairy Queen? Well, towel. The t so somebody got x-rays and thought, what if lead fest for comfort and fashion? And gives you the freedom to use your hands. We can see your wiener. Ideal to wear before a sweat. What better way to say I'm in a suicide cult but with a wearable towel? Wear it after regrettable sex. Comes in the towels say pool, but the lack of water says parking lot. Fasteners. The wearable towel is unisex and can be worn in a tunic style. <laughs> I'm getting paid in chase sandwiches. Hey, that dog's nude. Hurry while supplies last. Call right now, you'll qualify for the wholesale discount price of only $19.95. As an added bonus, we'll give you this backpack absolutely free. So Size is very. Four, four. Fog drains, slow drains, blockages or stoppages. Drain cleaners over promise and under deliver. Hi, Jason Williams here for Instant Plumber. Instant Plumber, just add crack. Actually, I think that might be Instant Toronto Math. Be clear clogged or slow moving drains. It's that easy. What? Wait, what is he doing with that hamster? Mr. Nibbles, no! Now, let's add kitchen grease and food. And toilet paper. Watch closely. Wow! The drain is freed instantly. Here's how it works. The graphic result of locking a marketer in a room with two pounds of Adderall and a flashlight. To through the blockage. Developed and used by master plumbers. Instant plumber is safe for old and new pipes. Even septic. Constipated? Shove it up your ass! Cat constipated? Shove it up your clogs ass! Clog. Who wants to see or smell that? Hey, that's not her fault. She has bad genes. Flow right past the clog. But with Instant Plumber, there's no hazardous chemicals, no mess. Most importantly, it works. Clear kitchen sinks and disposals fast. Regardless of how many hamsters you've disposed. Move hair and clogs in showers, bathtubs and sinks. Order your Instant Plumber and quick shot cap for the reduced price of only $10. What they don't show you is your shit comes spraying out your neighbor's sink like a suicide bomber at a Taco Bell. The 12 clogs. Offer not valid in Wisconsin. Yeah, those cheese shits are epic. And instant results. But wait, I'm still not done. We'll give you two free gifts. Free two-way adapter and a free easy reach handle. So when you combine all the free gifts, you get a plunger. That, that's a plunger. Yeah, but it's like a gas injecting shit spray and super plunger. Double your guarantee to 60 days. Instant Plumber clears blockages guaranteed. Or get your money back. This amazing offer is not available in stores. Is it not available or did they refuse to sell it? Got tough bathroom stains? Kaboom with OxyClean does more in your bathroom. Jesus Christ, what'd you do? Clean Nicolas Cage's career in there? 
door better than the leading brand. Kaboom breaks up hard water deposits. Put the power back in your shower. You don't need a cabinet full of cleaners. You need a therapist that understands summer camp issues. Kaboom with OxyClean does the hard work for you. But I can't unkill that homeless girl from three years ago. How do you clean your feet? You A question for the ages. Your tired feet looking young is such a chore, but not anymore. This is Easy Feet, a revolution in convenience. A now you can look like you have outstanding warrants in the shower. Rejuvenating bristles to gently massage and clean the top the bottom and even has a built-in pumice stone for rough cracked heels. Rough cracked heels is my stripper name. Thing of the past. Easy Feet makes me feel a lot more confident when wearing my strappy shoes. Easy Feet will literally change the way you bathe forever. Easy is demonstrated by this mildly horrifying animation. Gently exfoliates and eliminates dirt. And most importantly, Easy Feet cleans in between your toes. It's great because you don't have to bend over and worry. Should we be watching this? It's the kind of footage you'd find on an unlocked DVD at the bottom of a duffel bag. Ah. Just secure Easy Feet to any smooth shower or tub surface. Then set the easy to use timer and forget it. Carefree rotisserie chicken just like that. Wash for your feet. I tried to make it my car wash as a foot wash for your car. How'd it go? Nice results, a lot of penciled mustaches and trench coats. Times better, and I love it. The names of the witnesses have been changed to protect the innocent. Leave an easy feed in every tub and every shower. Along with a manifesto and list of demands. It only takes a minute to clean your feet. So stop doing that one-legged dance at And just like that, they lost the Amputee Coalition of America. Only $14.99. But when you call, we'll send you a second easy feed absolutely free. Just pay separate. You know, a lot of people don't know this, but Easy Feet was where Michael Jackson got the idea for the moonwalk. Oh, yeah? Yeah, he saw it and immediately started walking backwards. hey -oh. Stop that. What can you freeze and squeeze for slushies that please? Oh, I know this one. Iguanas. Jim has arrived. Let's get slushified. It's a slushy. Whoa, I'm getting a catchphrase freeze. Push your tongue to the top of your mouth, I heard that helps. So cool. Yeti will show you. Three weeks later, then the intern was found dead in the Sonoran Desert. The lid, wait for two, then all you do is... Squish, squish, squeezy. For... Wait a minute, that's not a Yeti, that's smiling Joe Biden. Wake up in the morning with a frosty orange juice. Just squeeze and let loose. Whoa, frozen. See, that's why you get the roof warranty. It's the winters that cause it, really. Lemonade snack and create an arctic blast. No, that's rad. No cubes, no shaking. Just easy squeezing and making. The secrets in the squishy polar chambers. Using arctic freeze to... Ah, yes, the polar chambers we've been hearing so much about from Minsa. Hey, Steve, should I be worried about the naked furry white humanoid? Nah, that's just free squatch flavors to get slushy treats that can't be beat. From an orange slush to frozen fruit punch, slushify any flavor you crave. A Tuna G slush, here I come. You're ready for the next one. Squeezy Freezy. You can call or log on to get your Squeezy Freezy kit and pick from four different colors of polar cups. Get an Arctic Dome lid, the special slushy spoon straw, and the Squeezy Freezy guide with funny yummy drinks inside. Yeti's not included. See, that's how they get you, and when you pay extra for the Yeti, it dies in a box on the way over from who gives a fuck a stand. You know, Jim, it's important to encourage our older citizens to stay active in their golden years. You couldn't be more right, Russ. Uh, just take this 70-year-old Minneapolis woman who allegedly threatened a state trooper with a fake gun made of duct tape and tin foil before climbing onto a bridge over an interstate with a bottle of tequila. <laughs> a trooper began following the woman's vehicle when she was observed driving erratically. Uh, when she was eventually pulled over, the woman, whose name is Jean Hansen, grabbed something that looked like a gun and pointed it at the trooper, who, of course, retreated to his squad car. Hansen sped away from the scene in her vehicle. <laughs> well, that'd be a full night for me, but Hansen had other plans. 
Whereas her car was later found nearby, Hansen was nowhere to be seen. Well, that's because she was hanging on the fence of the Pascal Street Bridge over Interstate 94, drinking from a bottle of tequila and grabbing at the silver gun-shaped object in her waistband. Along with, I'm assuming, an AARP card and some lint-covered Werther's Originals, officers recovered a replica handgun, knife, and another foil and duct tape object. <laughs> As if anybody had any doubts of how balls to the wall crazy this lady was, she later admitted to taking at least six diazepam pills before drinking the tequila. Uh, a mix that I like to call Alakazam Diazepam, you don't remember shit. You're not a bad bitch. I am a bad bitch. <laughs> Do you like it when I pull up my depends up into my ass crack like it's a never leaking thong? <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ, man. No, Grandma, I don't. I know you aren't a hard candy. I just want to go home. You know, in Japanese mythology, they have a thing called Uba Steak, whereby an infirm or elderly relative was carried to a remote, desolate place and left there to die. Sounds like this lady had the same idea, but it involves snorting cocaine off a stripper's dick. You know, Russ, what with all the problems with the viral infections and whatnot, there's been one profession that's been hit especially hard. Absolutely, our men and women on the front lines of the medical industry working tirelessly to ensure our continued safety. Well, yeah, sure, sure. But I was talking about the other frontline workers. Ah, all the service people out there making sure the businesses stay open and that we can continue to get what we need to keep going. Uh-huh, them too, but uh, still no. I'm talking about the other other frontline workers. Truckers? No. Teachers? No. Grocery store workers? No. So, did you do anything special for Thanksgiving? Yeah, my brother came by. Oh yeah? How is he? Dead. That's a shame. Yeah, we ate him. Police? No. Firemen? No. Emergency medical technicians? Wait, did you say prostitutes? No. Oh, well, yeah, it's prostitutes. In an effort to pump up business after Austria implemented its mandatory vaccine mandate, a brothel has begun offering a whale of a deal. That's right, Jim. The Fun Palace Sex Star Sauna Club is offering a 30-minute voucher with the lady of your choice with every vaccine administered on site. Yes, and Austria can use all the help it can get now that COVID-19 cases are spiking and just 64% of the population is fully vaccinated. Here's to you who make your living on your back, ensuring some others get to keep living, too. Prost! And that's the show. Yep, as my great-great-grandfather used to say. When I was a boy, we used to shit outside in a box. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Check out our other show required reading, and click the link in the description to see all the cool gear in our merch store. He used to say that, and then some really racist stuff about silverfish. To play us out, here's Salty and the Bacons with their new song, For You. The snow is falling, and the lights are twinkling. So what to get the girl? Who has everything? Well, on monkey day, I'll put the toilet seat down. And on Kwanzaa, I'll do the dishes. During Hanukkah, I'll stop chewing my nails. For green bean casserole day, you can the remote all for you this year on boxing day I'll give up smokes and sock day will be my last gamble at cards for international cheater day I'll stop following you to work 
bathtub party day I'll skip morning vodka All for you this year To celebrate National Gaspacho Day I'll release one of the hostages I'll take the disembodied head out of our freezer on Walt Disney Day Guess whose wedding band is coming back on Pawnbroker's Day To ring a national microwave day I'll tell the FBI where the bodies are buried All for you this year On National Cotton Candy Day I'll sell my panel band at the Feast of Immaculate Conception, I'll wear protection. Carl, that kills people on National Llama Day. On International Day of Veterinarian Medicine, I'll skip the ketamine. All for you. On weary willy day, need I say more? I'll return my copy of the satanic verses on Dewey Decimal Day. We'll firebomb a KFC on Animal Rights Day. And on National Gingerbread House Day, I'll kick out the squatters and their gingerbread meth lab. All for you this year We'll stick to the right hole on ding -a ling day During Worldwide Candle Day I won't murder and eat the neighbors On National Salesperson Day I will murder and eat the local door-to-door -door salesmen and on Christmas Eve, I'll disable the booby traps. All for you this year. Christmas Day underneath the tree will be the antidote for you from me. On New Year's Eve, when the ball drops, I promise not to staple a living squirrel to your forehead and then blind you with angel dust. Again. On New Year's Day, I promise I'll do it all over again.